Hello everyone, welcome back to Hypermind Modded Server with our amazing wall impossible block of diamond that should not exist. That'd be cool to actually put around a uh ah, Damn you OBS. That'd be a cool thing to put around one of these, just have an orb around your aura nodes. Ow! Stupid, stupid plants. Um Oh no my bag. Um I don't want to steal those, so... Yeah, how do they go in my bag? Ooh. Isn't that off? I oh, know, that's on. Uh, other things off. Right! So, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the Hypermind modded server. It's been quite a while since I've been on here. Um, I've been very, very busy in real life recently. I've been doing so many more things. It's unbelievable. I've been doing... Uh, Warhammer 40k, the real life models, and that's going really cool. I'm enjoying that a lot. Um, ooh, that's a bit flashy down there. I may not, I probably won't put anything about that on this channel, but I am thinking about making another channel to do that content on. Uh, just upload like my painting builds, maybe some games if I get around to doing them. But I've got some things that are looking really cool with there, and I'm really enjoying that as a new hobby that I've sort of got back into because I used to. I used to play uh, the Dawn of War games, they were really good. Dawn of War games back on. Um, PC ooh, years ago now. So we're getting into that. I uh, also yesterday first Dungeons and Dragons game ever. Finally got around to playing that. Finally achieved true geek status. I am now a true geek. That's right. So I did that. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I was the dungeon master. So that was quite interesting. I mean, I've done uh, role play things before. Um, things like World of Warcraft and things like that, so I have some idea of what I was doing, but it's it's definitely something to take some thinking and getting used to, but I, a lot of fun with that. But we are on Minecraft, so let's get to Minecraft things. So that's obviously my old base, we know about that, we know about my um, other base, which yeah, yeah that's there. Yeah. We're not going to talk about that, that was sort of a failed project, and um, being a bit close to the uh, the uh, blah, 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 ocean carrier, sea liner, whatever it is, uh, I decided to leave it so that place can be bombed to hell for all I care. So we're back here at spawn because I thought, right, spawn, right here. Let's do something close. Not a big pit in the ground. Let's do the opposite of a big pit in the ground. So I came over here, I came past the bushes, came past uh, Drax's little hut. And went, you know, what's the opposite of a big pit in the ground? Giant massive tower. Oh yeah. Giant massive tower. So let's yeah. made this this uh, little shell of a tower, so we can see it goes nice and high. Ooh, that looks a bit weird. I haven't actually been inside since I put the roof on. So you see, we've got a big tower goes past the cloud level, right up here. Probably take all these out. Yeah, not gonna bother though. We so giant tower made of wood, made of wood, not very sturdy and secure. That's because it's powered by magic. Oh yeah, we're going to do magic, because machinery is all well and good. We're going to have a bit of machinery in here, probably like ME terminals and things like that. But for the most part, this is going to be... Oh, that's a good angle. This is a good angle. You can see it's a rickety witch's tower we're going to be building here. And yeah, we've got little towers on the side of things like that that we can add in. I've still got to finish terraforming up the landscape um, and doing the inside, but it should look well and good. Now, I'm aware, because it's been a while since my last video... Um, that people probably a bit out of the loop of where I'm at gear wise. I'm rocking all end game gear. This is all red matter from Project E, which is super overpowered and I basically cannot duck. Sorry. Sorry. I won't land on your house again, Dolan. But yeah, I'm basically invincible, uh, unless I probably go to the end and stuff like that. So I'm proper kitted out. I've got amazing uh these are just ultimate mining tools, so if we just is there any grass I could do a clearing out? Let's clear out this little hill and I can just show you how quick I clear. Yeah. It's gone. It's gone, basically. Nothing to see. So I've got tools that can chop down any foot. So, the point of this is not to get awesome tools. We have awesome tools. i got some awesome shurikens. They have life stealing as well, so I'm even harder. Ow! I hit myself! I don't know if that's impressive. I'm not even mad. I hit myself. That's... I wonder if I get a skill for that. Hut! So it's at uh, 898. Uh, ow! 898. 
Oh my god, I can actually get skill by just shooting myself with my shurikens. Come on, ow! Oh no, they're all gonna miss now! Ow! Okay, that's how you I'm gonna level up like this, I'm just gonna juggle for a bit. And smack me in the face! Oh, where'd the other one go? Oh, I picked it up. So that's actually how I can level that up, that's cool. I got my my stupid hammer of stupidness, which, you know, has got so many modifiers on it. It's my weapon and my mining tool, so that's really cool. Right, so the main point of this, getting magic stuff, we're going to do witchery and farmcraft. They're the main two. There's a few other ones that I was going to look into, but witchery and farmcraft, server reset in 10 minutes. No! Okay, I'm going to have to... um. Wait for after the reset. So that actually gives me time to put in some floors and some stuff that we can actually do some build work on. So I will do that and I will be back after the reset to show you where we're at. Back in a moment. And welcome back to the server. One quick shower and reset later. We're back in the server. I've got the floor done and we're starting on the door. So you can see we've got a nice floorway. There's going to be a stairway here, which is why I haven't filled this bit in. Now these, these are pretty cool. These are wooden vanishing frames. Now if I fill these in with the glass, okay, so you can see we just, eh, if right click, nothing happens. So we're going to need some pressure pads. I do not have any apparently, so let's get some stone. I'm just going to, oh I saw you wiggle, I saw you wiggle. We're going to get some pressure plates, quickly learn it. If we put that there, oof, and it's back again. There's no way in at the moment, which is a bit of a dirt for me. So we would want to make a player sensor. I don't think I have saved, even if it is savable. It is savable. Player. And no, it is not. Okay, so we're going to need glass. Uh, iron redstone, glass. Now I know this thing can be a little cheaty, but uh, you know I quite like using it because it just makes things easier and quicker for me at this early stage of building. So we're going to make one player sensor. I'm going to quickly learn it in case I need it again. And if I put that up there, oh no, we need that on the outside, don't we? Shoop. Okay, so if we put it. There, <clears throat> we can walk up. Awesome, so that's working as intended. So now mobsters, well, mobsters, monsters shouldn't be able to get in because obviously that's a player sensor, not a mob sensor. So what happens if we come at an angle? Okay, that works as well, that's cool. I may, I'm gonna get another player sensor and we'll put this one on the inside rather than having this on the floor, we'll have that which is a bit more subtle. Okay, so let's give that a test once that pressure plate's gone. Saw that wiggle. Okay, it's a bit slower getting out, but it works getting in absolutely fine. So, now it's a matter of doing some decorations so we can get things like uh, tables. Da -da 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 -da. Where's the ones I want? Where are the ones I want? So, we've got some bibliocraft tables, we can do some of them. Oh, we've got wrong type of wood on us. I don't know why they wiggle. I may need to um, change what they're made of because there are more expensive versions. So let's get some tables. We're just going to make this a nice little entranceway sort of thing. So we get two tables. Let's get some carpet. I don't think I actually have any, so we're going to grab some wool. Let's go like that. How can you make from this? Can you change the colour while it's in this mode? Okay, now so you need to make it while it's like that. So in that case, I need some red. Ooh, that rose. Oh, we don't have any of that saved. We're gonna have to go and hunt for a rose. A rose by any other name. But we're definitely making some good progress. Aha! I will replace this Dolan. Good poppy, anyway, isn't it? Derp. Yeah, I just want to learn how to make this poppy. I will put it back, just in case that was some very, very delicate flower arranging he had going on there. So we've learnt the poppy, which we didn't have, so I didn't need it. Fly on back. 
and we'll just drop that down. We pop. Okay, so we flower beds back intact. We just quickly learnt how to make a poppy, which would be very, very good. Hoppa. Right. So one poppy. The reason I want that is because rose red. We're going to quickly learn that as well. Because I think a red boop and a boop. A red covering is more witchy than a white one. Look at that. That's looking good. Now, what can we put on that? What can we put on that? We can make a crystal ball, I believe. What is that? How do I get that? Oh, okay, can't get that. Uh, da -da -da -da, there's a crystal ball somewhere. Ah, I've got to make that with a spell then. So it looks like we're not going to be making that or placing that yet. But I do want to get a crystal ball down here so I can spy on the other players when they're online. So, what I need to do is just do some general decorating. I need to do the walls because this is a mess. I need to put something, you know, just sort of in here to see. You can't see the uh, the outside wall itself. And there's all these blocks which I've just realised I don't actually need. Oops, turn that off. Which means I'm going to need some more flooring from in there and that sort of thing. But more space gives me some time to clean up the area. So I'll be back once that's done. Or actually, no, no, actually, what I'll do is I'll wrap up the episode here, have it a bit of a short one, because I have uh, some stuff to do. Damn it, I thought I could make that, but I don't have that. Uh, I've got some stuff to do that's going to take a little while, so we'll put this quick one out for you guys today. Uh, ooh, there's so much stuff I get to look at. And uh, I will get this first entranceway done, and I will have the first layer of stuff up there, and we will begin with some magic. So, thanks for watching, guys. If you have any comments or suggestions, feel free to leave them down below, and I will see you in the next one. Toodles!